Thank you for having me. Yes, it is set during the French and Indian War, and it is the story of two young girls who are captured by the Native Americans, and it's essentially their story of faith, hope, and survival. Yes, she is the older sister, and um, actually an amazing, inspiring story. I think when you play a true story, well, first, you have to be so authentic, so that was, that was an element that adds you know, to your acting, um, but I think just to see her character and be inspired by her as a person was really a great experience. Well, I think, you know, anything you can learn about history, I've always loved history, and so to be a part of history was really fun, and to see it come to life. I do do my own stunts, I love that. And um, this particular one was so much fun, because it was in the fall, and the mountains, waterfalls, incredible scenery, and to be able to run, did lots of running, and um, horseback riding, as well as some water sports, and I learned a little bit of lacrosse, so that was fun. There's so many messages. Actually, it's such, it really is an impactful story. And I think, especially since it's a true story, you can see that other people endured really hard things and they came out and survived. And another theme, I think, especially with the Father's Day weekend opening, that's so poignant and beautifully portrayed is the impact that fathers can have on their families and their children. And to see how what this father spoke to his children um, really carries them through hard times, I think is a great message that I hope you know, fathers and parents really feel inspired by. If you go to the Alone Yet Not Alone website, they have a list of where the film opens and, you know, what theaters and that kind of thing. But I think continue to check because I think that list is growing daily. <laughs> so check back if it's not in your area and, um, you know, just check it that way. Also, I would love for people to go to my website which is my name, kellygrayson.com, and see the other films. Hopefully I have four coming out this year, so I'd love everybody to see all of those because so many, I've been able to be a part of so many films that are just really amazing stories. And um, also you can keep up to date on what projects I'm working on and that kind of thing. Thank you, you too.